Alrighty, it's your boys, the Elks, it's the legendary one, and today we're going to be talking about if you should build slash max out art book Ichigo. Now, before we get in, I don't know if I already put the disclaimer anywhere. Um, not disclaimer, but like the little like notice type thing. I don't know when I'm gonna edit that into these uh the series yet, but um realistically you can max out whoever you want. Right? I'm not sure that um all I want is for players to have fun. I'm not gonna tell you to go crazy super saiyan on this character this character, right? Um I just want you to have fun on the game, right? But for the people who let's say are new or the people who just get these characters and they don't you know they just care about power and they don't really care about um you know thing they just want to know if you should max them out or not then these videos are basically for you type thing right so um yeah let's talk about art book ichigo now the reason why for the series i started off with aizen and art book ichigo is because i feel like they're the most pushed out characters right now i mean just in general they're the, probably the most pushed out characters I don't remember Bia. I mean, Bia and Ichigo were kind of pushed out like this too. But no, no, actually not really. Look, Aizen and Ichigo are on the beginner kickoff. So if you're new, you can re-roll for one of the two. Not only that, I believe um, when you're a new player, you get like a free multi for like five to seven days. I don't remember what number it is. But you're guaranteed a five star there too. And our book Ichigo and Aizen are there too. They're the only characters that were on Brave Fest where you're guaranteed those types of characters. Um, and they were on the anniversary banner and now for the new choose a six star or like the choose a six star where you pick 10 characters and you randomly get one they're gonna be there too which they should have already been there but for the compensation on the 25th they're gonna be there again they're the most pushed out characters right now so i feel like everybody should have these characters by this unless you're a new player i don't know how you don't have these characters um because they're always on good banners really um so yeah but let, let, let's talk about if you should max out this Ichigo. So now this Ichigo is a very good character. Um, top three tech in the game. I do think Aizen is just better. Um, even though this Ichigo has double killer and he's faster and all that stuff. Um, Aizen is just, he's just so like, you can depend on him like crazy, right? He has the multi barrier. He has the boost, built in boost, the 80% attack boost, the gauge boost. Like he hits so hard. It's crazy how Aizen actually works. I don't know what they were thinking when they did that, but let's talk about this Ichigo. So off rip, this Ichigo has 843 SP. Not bad, um, obviously, because I think the highest we have now is 800 and what is it like 864? Let me check. Uh, is it 864 or something like that? That's not a resurrection, yeah. 864 from the uh, seventh anniversary Ichigo, right? He has weaken on everything, he has soul reaper and no affiliation killer, which is very good. He has built in SAR. Um, negative 14%, which is really good too. Obviously, it's better than 12%. He has Berserker plus 60%, Bombardment plus 1, um, Bruiser plus 20%, Debilitator plus 5 seconds, Frenzy plus 1, Havoc plus 20%, Marauder, um, and then Poise. And then for innate skills, he has All Status Immunity, Long Stride, and Sprinter plus 2. So he's a fast character. Um, this Ichigo was actually like a mid-month character. I believe he came on on the 15th of last year, right before the anniversary. Right, let me just check. Um, oh, I have to go to basic. Yeah, so he came on. He's like, he basically was a mid-month character, but he had Havoc, right? So that's why it was like everybody was kind of making a super fuss out of him, right? But he is very good, right? Um, him, he's probably going to be like your go-to character if you just want to blitz through things. Um, because he is very fast, right? Having Sprinter plus two and long stride, and then also putting out that kind of power is insane. Him having the 60% Berserker, I think is very nice. He has two really good killers, right? No affiliation is more common now. And then Soul Reaper is very common as well. Um, I think the only common ones are really are Soul Reaper, Hollow, Aronkar, and no affiliation. Those are like the top four killers. Um, or top four affiliations that enemies are really having, right? Quincy is okay, like somewhat their humans. You're only going to really see that in Senkaiman, I think. Um, so, yeah, the old killers are really nice, right? Um, and even in like Arena and Brave Battle. I mean, I don't know if people really use this Ichigo in Brave Battle. But in Arena, right, a lot of people are Soul Reapers. And then you got, um, is Bruno no affiliation? It might be, right? You got Bruno who's no affiliation, which that handles that, I guess. So, um, 
yeah, he's a really good character, right? Um, so let's talk about what, you know, you should be getting for him. So I did get him T20. I do think he is a character you should get T20. In terms of accessories, this is literally his best, well, I think this would be his best set here. Um, if you don't have the T ceremony set, you can just replace this with a hunting cap if you just want full damage. If not, you can give him, I mean, a Zeta pill right because he doesn't have hit hitting enemies but then you can also give him that on his bonus abilities which is what i did i gave him full stamina damage boost on t15 and then hit hitting enemies um right just to get rid of those enemies quickly this is up to you the last one you can change it between let me just pull it up right you could change it between hit hitting enemies um and let's see i mean you could do damage to weaken enemies if you want i feel like this is a, a lot more uh, a really nice. I, I really do. Me personally, I really like these damage to like uh, specific enemies, right? I do like it a lot. Um, right? He does have bombardment too, so you can give him weakened defense. It's not bad if you give him that, right? Um, most people probably gave him weakened defense um, or hit hitting enemies. I gave him hit hitting enemies. I just can't be bothered with the Zeta pill on him, right? Um, so yeah, these is probably his best. Uh, and you can change your lieutenant dodge for the hunting cap too if you don't have it. I don't know how you don't have this, but if you don't, then you can. But yeah, and then for links, I think this soy fun is um, well. These are my two favorite links on him. I just have the Kugel here because I wanted more damage. But realistically, um, I do really like and care about my full stamina. So if I do somehow take damage, let's say, um, I do prefer having the Tenza link. Actually, let me show you what link that is. Um, Right, I do prefer having this link right where it's SAR and uh, recover stamina between areas. I really do prefer these links for my like, This is just me personally. I like this link a lot more. Um, right, this is my favorite type of link in the game for any character the healing and then the SAR. Right, I love putting this on all my characters that have full stamina just in case I do take damage. Right, if I'm autoing and they take damage, they go to the next area and boom. So there is that right in terms of his specials you should be getting this up i'm one to talk i haven't gotten it up that's mainly because i haven't been focusing on this ichigo really um now i'm focusing on um my brave battle characters more right so um that's why these are not leveled up right? i didn't really start using this ichigo until like what two weeks ago really so there is that but um you can also just use him as a link if you don't want to really use him he does have the 14 percent sar which is really good right but um yeah i think he is a character you should be maxing out um completely right you don't have to rush to do it i say that all the time because you know there's no need to rush but you know you should get him one of if you don't have any characters t20 let's say he should be one of your first options to get him i know a lot of people get this guy t20 instantly when they can um just because of how useful he is right again having two common uh, killers is going to be good for pve content and then being able to dash around the map with the sprinter plus two and long stride for the people who do not know what long stride is it makes your dash go farther than what a normal dash should be um right being able to do that is really good right so yeah i would say he's a character you should t20 again the full stamina boost i think every character that's a I mean, even NAD characters can get this realistically because this doesn't have to be only to SP characters, right? I think my Aizen actually has full stamina, right? Um, right? I think, I mean, full stamina should be on everybody, realistically, right? Um, and then hit hitting enemies, again, you can give him weakened defense since he has bombardment um, or damage to weakened enemies. I just do not like him having the Zeta pill on, so I gave him hit hitting enemies. But yeah, this Ichigo is definitely somebody you should invest in heavenly. Um, a really good unit again still top 10 till this day probably the second best tech character in the game right after aizen in my opinion but um yeah you guys let me know if um you built him and what you guys actually gave him on his t20 i'm curious what most people gave him on his t20 if they gave him hit hitting enemies or weakened defense or damage to weaken enemies those are the only three that i think would work perfectly for him you can give him start barrier i mean if you want i don't know why you would but if you want to um you could right um i don't know if people are making like a brave fest. probably not making a brave fest version or not brave fest a brave battle version of this ichigo like they did the aizen but yeah i think for the skills you should have for full stamina damage for your first one on t15 then t20 should be weak in defense hit an enemy 
or um, weaken to damaged enemies. Those are it. You guys let me know what your Ichigo is looking like. And I'll see you guys in the next one. I'm out. Peace.